Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Doğan and I'm student at Gelsip Çevre University and my department is Electrical and Electronics Engineering. Uh, today I will present you my project. I did this project in microprocessor lecture. Uh, my project is Burtle Alarm System and uh, it's my code. Uh, let's start. Uh, first, I will introduce uh, the equipment. Uh, this LM044 L LCD. This is a LCD keypad and door uh, LED and alarm LED and buzzer. In the this LED is outside of door. This real time model as you can see here this is pressure sensor mpx 41 15 and this is important for us because uh, it's uh, we can say this magnetic contactor in real life <sighs> okay let's enter our password press star As you can see here, you see this is 4564 SIM EPROM. Let's enter this password. And here, this is outside of door, this is inside of door. You can enter from here. As you can see, door opened. Welcome. You can see door is opened, and door is opened, and we see welcome text. I made it a little bit to finish. Okay, it turns, and let's. Uh, I want to. Mention about my algorithm. <coughs> if the user enters correct password inside of the uh, door, there is uh, on the ground there is a pressure sensor as you can see here. This pressure sensor uh, starts from 15 to uh, 120, I think. When password is right and uh, if you press this pressure sensor on the ground, uh, the alarm will not uh, raise. Let's try. We will again enter the password and we will open. And after 20, uh, we will see this magnetic contact uh, for our door. Yes, as you can see here, I'm increasing, but the alarm is not occurred, as you can see. You can close the door here. Yes. Uh, <coughs> I look my notes to some. Uh, tests here <coughs> in this screen. Uh, these are these are yeah. I mean this LCD and this LCD connect same port because micro C <coughs> has only one function to LCD. Let's assume we are administrator and we want to. Uh, we, we need to uh, access the admin menu in that case this outside of door we can click the switch and this one and we are inside let's click and this is 7898 as you can see here okay 
rearranging I'm wrong so you write again let's try search change it's not change anyways it's not uh, so important we will change the password and here as you can see the sour menu daily mode all day mode change at the pass allow more to them to load daily mode and holiday mode change the normal password and as you can see we access admin menu but outside of door the text is press star let's change daily mode password uh, enter new code let's say 4565 and now we can close it of course we must close and press Star again, telegrams. Yeah, we changed password as you can see. We changed, but it don't uh, it doesn't come because because of the uh, Proteus, I think. Let's enter new password as you can see. Door open, welcome. Uh, we are waiting. This process uh, is the same but I want to do finish this video earlier. Let's enter the admin menu. Oh yeah. Seven eight nine seven. Okay. And holiday mode. Let's we can change password. Four, five, six, four. Yeah, you can see. It's done. It's a dumb message. Okay. Um, we can answer, but it's a waste of time. And you can change admin password from here. Enter new code. Let's say let's enter this one and square down to message. And press star. Press star. Uh, we will enter new code. So eight nine eight and hash. As you can see, we change that password. The daily mode and whole day mode do the same process. They call the same function. But for the development part, we can change the properties of these two um, function mode, daily mode and whole day mode. And Let's, let's close and open it again. Okay. As you can see in the screen. Before mention uh, about the pressure sensors, I, I I have to explain how does it work. Let's look our codes. Yeah, in it 
timer 0 I use timer 0 in terms initializing timer 0 uh, it just t0 con register I think look data sheet here this timer 0 checks a in every 50 milliseconds this interrupt for timer 0 the time to interrupt like the occur as you can see these these are really important part here okay if alarm set flag is one just read fresh sensor and if we have three conditions to raise an alarm first one is alarm set is one uh, in normally alarm set uh, flag is one when uh, the password is correct it will be zero because of that reason uh, there is no an alarm case there won't be an alarm case if alarm set is one and pressures larger than than a value which is 20 and for c r c1 is zero means uh, our as you can see here magnetic con uh, conductor in real life okay sorry this is flag uh, i didn't choose but it can be used for instruments and for c rb01 the for alarm activated and the for uh, buzzer activated in this time we we can read real time module as you can see here time date values as case uh, pass it okay uh, so let's open it and in this screen um, this is door I opening I'm opening and I'm increasing but as it as you can see here There is an alarm is okay. In this case, we will close the door and enter our password for closing. It's the four five five four five. Yes, as you can see, we close the alarm. And in this function, I saved the real time data to EPRO. And here, let's access the admin menu. I don't remember password if I have to write. Yeah, yes. As you can see here, this is time and this date 19.05.2018. This is the time as you can see here and it waits 10 seconds and then return and lastly let's enter wrong password not we see access denied again okay. let's enter X tonight, and we are playing it's tonight. And as you can see, warning the other is occurred, and outside of door light is flashing, as you can see here. Yes, as you can see, and lastly. If <coughs> if your neighbor wants to come to you and your uh, home number is five plus this one you can enter five 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 do we open the door for gas as you can see here yeah we can see neighbor can enter it waits ten seconds here and it takes this value and as you there it will be light on. 
as you can see we need to switch off again and we can cannot uh, accept the any guest and so that's it thank you for listening uh, don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel see you in another video